this is it, Dawson Place Child Advocacy Center. When Mark Rowe looks back on his accomplishments over more than 31 years as a Snohomish County prosecutor, this is the one thing he takes the most pride in. There's our namesake, uh, Seth Dawson. The creation of the Dawson Place Child Advocacy Center. It means they've already had something bad happen to them. The least we can do is not make it worse. The center helps guide thousands of child victims of neglect and abuse through the legal system. Rowe was instrumental in helping it get built back in 2006. Hey, young lady, how you doing? Among its many success stories, Ivy Jacobson, who was abused by her father as a child. Rowe helped put him in prison, and Dawson gave Ivy and her family the strength they needed to get through it all. He showed us that he believed in, in us and that we were going to get through the battle of you know being free and seeing what freedom was going to be like for our family. Mark Rowe has earned a reputation as a tough prosecutor who hates wearing a tie almost as much as he loves his wife Lisa, a fellow prosecutor whom Rowe calls one of his heroes. I have my blood pressure cuff here. After a recent health scare, Lisa wrote her husband a letter that he keeps framed in his office and he knew it was time for a change. I'm ready um, to take a little vacation. I mean, I'm proud, incredibly proud of the work that Lisa and I have done all these years and I believe we've done it well, but it has taken a toll. After a three decades long career, Mark Rowe says he never really won a single case. That's because he can't erase the harm done to so many victims. But through Dawson, there are victories. Victories like Ivy Jacobson, who is now a Bothell police officer. On our tombstones, our prosecutorial tombstones, I'd like it to say Mark and Lisa had some small part in the much greater effort to see to it that kids got treated better. Eric Wilkinson, King 5 News.